So today I'm going to be planning, I already did my monthly spread for October, I'm planning for September 28th to October 4th, next week. I have all my stickers that I need over here. Um, I'll show you my, my theme. I'm doing a donut theme using this pink one with this sort of pattern a green washi and a purple washi. Um, my theme for this week is donut. Donuts. I have a bunch of, I have a donut post-it note I'm going to try to use. I got these purple post-it notes from Target that I will try to use. And of course, I have tons of donut stickers from the Dollar Tree. So let's get going. This is my first time, so bear with me. Um, like I said, I have um, printed up my own stickers, and you will see them in my spread. So what I usually do first is I will lay out my washi on the bottom. So I'm going to go and do that. Make sure things are out of my way. And I do the post-planning, or no, pre-planning pre with my little post-it notes anything that comes up I pop it down so I don't ruin the actual planner beforehand and I learned to use like a credit card or I just use the ruler to cut my washi Oh, and sometimes it doesn't break even, but that's okay. So that's all set. And I have over here my little bin to put all my trash from the stickers and my post-it notes once I'm done. So I think... I'm going to put the green down below with this pink. And this here isn't my favorite. This is like a scotch tape. but So it's kind of iridescent, but it'll work for down here. So you can still see through it. But what I usually do is you'll see when I put my stickers, I will put stickers kind of over here. So you won't notice it. And what I'll do is the purple later, I will, it's going to be wide. I don't have any, I'm trying to get some thin washi. So right now I have to do with what I have. I might see if I can cut this or it'll just be a wider one. All right, next what I usually do is I take this off, a donut theme. And that's all set. I have, I use my sidebar for meal planning. And what I do is I just wrote out, because I start off with Monday, right? And I go down to Sunday. So when I have this week right now that we're in, um, I have these right here. These are the blank um, flags that you get with your Erin Condred. And I just pick two colors and I do opposite Monday through Sunday. So right now I did meal plan. I go to the market on a Thursday. So I have Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, what I know I'm going to have. And then they'll be empty for the rest of the week. So I usually take just... Um, a black pen when I fill those out. So I'm going to pick my colors that I want to use. These are just hanging out over here and I'm making a mess. Okay, so I think, let's see, if I do the green here, I got a bunch of those and I'll finish up maybe using these here. We're going to put them, and I just line them up with the lines. I 
and I kind of leave a little bit so it's like they're not even like I do one out one in one out one in just to look kind of cool and this gives the layout some more color that will match and it really makes it stand out your meal planning um, I like to be able to put stickers and washi down here because I love washi um, I can show you after a, um, a meal planner that I did have my mother bought me when she got me the planner and it was the whole length here and it had the breakfast lunch and dinner and I don't need that I just want for dinner so once I used up those six now I'm doing this and I like this a lot better I can match the color to the theme so we got Monday Tuesday Wednesday Thursday Friday Saturday and one more and I end up using up all of my reddish pink one here and I do have to order more from Erin Condred because like I said I love these now for meal planning so I will get my black pen and what I do is I just write here on that flag that they give you I write meals And then I'll write the day, just an abbreviation, and I'll write in the meals. So here I just wrote my three meals, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. And then on Wednesday, when I make up the market list for the next week, I'll fill in the rest. Now, like I said, I can't afford a lot of stickers, so I print my own. The one thing that I can't really print right now is my headers. So what I do is I just use my, sometimes I use colored to match, which maybe I will. Um, I'm going to do pink and purple. And I do family, to do, and YouTube. So I'm going to do that now. And by using the color, it gives some more color to your spread. And then that's why I just try to coordinate something that's going to match the color of the month. And being gray, it's a nice neutral that things kind of match it really nicely. And so up here in my family boxes is where I will write in whoops, um, the children's sports. Um, and anything that we're doing family related. And then my to do's. Let me do this before I mix it up. And I've used a few of the weekend banners that I've gotten for free as the free when my mom did order me some stuff on Etsy, but I am going to be placing an order today. I'm really excited for Oh Hello. Um, I love your love your YouTube channel and love your shop. So I am going to be ordering some stuff. I do have some extra cash and I, I need some stuff. So now we'll go back and write in to do. Thinking why spend money when there's already a nice color and I can just fill in the words with my colored pens. So I probably, I mean, unless as I get way older and the kids aren't costing me tons of money, maybe then, because I plan on doing my planner for years, it's a really good way to stay organized and I just love using stickers to decorate. Okay, so now we'll start with the family and add our stuff. Let's open this up. Okay, so first what I do, and it's funny because the family is pretty much, I know my son has football Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Um, Monday, he won't have it if he wins the game on Sunday, so then that'll be taken away if 
it gets canceled. My daughter has cheerleading Wednesday, Thursday, Saturday morning. Um, <clears throat> and then there's scouts on Thursday for the two boys. And I'm waiting to find out. My daughter started scouts, but we don't know when the meeting is yet. Um, so I have here, if you haven't seen my other videos, these here from Dollar Tree. I label them with some labels that I get all the time at Dar Target or Dollar Tree. And I just keep my stickers in these. Let's see. So I need sports. And of course, I can't find it. Okay. So here's my sports. So this is one sticker my mom got me off Etsy, my little cheerleaders. And I did have... Let me show you the word that says cheer um, to go along with it, but I ran out. I guess they had more of these cheerleaders than the words. So let's see, so cheerleading is Wednesday and Thursday. I usually put them down here on the corner because it's at night and then Saturday morning. My son's football, which these here are ones I printed up, and I don't know if I have any more. It's like all the sports, and I have to see if I have any more footballs. Oh, there's some. There's one. So what I did is I cut them just a little square, but now when I plan, I try to cut off the excess. So that way it's not too big and looking too silly. And it doesn't take you too long to just clip that. And that's why I end up needing a little trash bin to add to all these. So I'll put on for Monday, football. And if I don't have any more of these football ones, I do have a Darcy sports one that does have footballs in it that are a little bit bigger than this so it looks like I don't see any I'm gonna have to start looking just to make some footballs I can do those today so I'll have them for next month All right. let me get my book so yes, it's a Darcy's Darcy book, and let's get the little footballs. And there we go. So they're a little bit bigger. do is with my pens let me get my pens I'm gonna write with I'm gonna be doing the pink purple and green and these are just paper me ink joy 1.0 M and I'll do a green up here and write in football six to seven thirty And cheer. And then she only has cheer. Okay, so next I'm going to do is the TV for the week. So again, I have my little TVs, and I'm just going to cut around the edge, which I do when I plan, because when I printed them, I didn't want to waste too much time. So I'll just cut them out to how I like them. And again, I'll explain to you as I do this that I just found these off, um, you know, I, I, I use Bing, Bing images. 
and copy and pasted them onto a Word document, and that's it. You might want to change the margins so that you have a little bit of that space filled in, because they do when you make like a Word document, there's always the border margins, and you'll have empty sticker space. I learned that from the beginning. <clears throat> so my first few, I lost some sticker space, but I learned. And um, so right now I'm home by myself. The house is quiet. The kids are at school. My daughter's in um, kindergarten now, so I'm all to myself. Um, I'm looking for a job in the process. So I'm enjoying the time now until I get my job. Um, let's see. And I'm not sure what night I'm going to be with TV this week. Um, Marek has got talents done. And now it's the fall. Um, I know there's a few shows that I want to watch, but they don't start till October. So that might be like next week. I think I don't even need five. I think I just need four. Um, what else I do is I do geocaching, but I do it on the weekends with my stepson so that's this week coming up so I've already got that on my schedule so this weekend I won't be doing it unless we have time and we feel like doing one without him which we haven't done yet but he knows that we might do some without him um okay so let's think of what tv shows and I'm gonna write those in and stick these stickers down Okay, so I put in the TV programs. Next, we have Mass on Sunday morning, which will be after my children's football game. They play 8.30 to 9.30, and Mass is for 10.30. So I put in a cross that I printed up, and I'm just cutting around the edge. Here. And that will go over here. And I will write it in. Thirty. <clears throat> All right. When I have this open, um, actually, I'm not going to. We're going to wait on that. I have other ones in here after um let's see I add on the bottom on Sunday a little lunch box on Sundays in the evening either right after I am getting cooking with dinner or afterwards when I'm cleaning it up I will make the um, 10 lunches for Monday through Friday for the two kids. I have the um, plastic sandwich containers and then I put them in a bin in the fridge that I got at Dollar Tree. So that reminds me to make lunches. have these little ones I didn't show you that come in a two pack at Dollar Tree for my stickers as well this has ballet shoes for my daughter um, normally she goes Saturday mornings but this year she did cheerleading and it intertwines with that so we're doing makeup for now for five weeks on Wednesday 
So we're going to just add this. Let me uh, trim this a little. So now with fall TV, I have not a lot of room, but we'll just, let's just overlap it right here. So I have to remember ballet. And that's four to five. Okay. Clean up some trash. <clears throat> also in here we have a blue cross, which is for my son just started CCD. And his CCD class is on Tuesday. I have right here, 3.45 to 4.45. So on that day, I go and I pick up Ben and Emma at one school. Then we go, which is right around the corner from my house. Then we just go down about five minutes to get my stepson, come back and go around the corner to the church and give him for CCD. So he has on Tuesday CCD. And I'm gonna write that in. Let me say Ben CCD 345. Sorry for the phone. All right, just answered the phone. It was my husband. All right, so in my next little bin, I try to do game night, family game night on Saturdays. Um, so we're going to add that in. I printed up a little Monopoly. And then little dice. So Saturday night, and this is with the family. So we know what to do. Let's see. Just trim that a little. And like last Saturday, we did video games. So, because he had just gotten a new video game. So, yeah. We'll do. So after bath or whatever. We'll do family game night. I also would like to do, not every weekend, but for special times, um, movie night. So, on either a Friday or a Saturday, and being we don't have anything other than the football game Sunday morning, I'm going to give them Friday night movie night. So we'll do that. And I don't know right now what movie. Something um, they haven't seen. Or something of their favorite. So, okay. So, we got to do the football game on Saturday. So I grab my Darcy book. And what I've been doing is trying to put one of these football helmets to go with the color. And I got this one here. It's a pink. Put that. And then I'll just write in football game and I'll write in after I don't know I know it's what time but I don't know where it is because this weekend is homecoming so I'm sure we're away next week so football game at I could put 8 30 and then we'll find out where it is later um <clears throat> let's see All right, now we come back to this little bucket. Oh, wait. No, that I do all my to-dos. All right, so next I want to do, oh, Scout on Thursday. 
That's new. That's why I almost forget. So my younger son is a tiger cub. So we put the tiger cub badge. Again, I printed myself just a couple weeks ago. And then the older boy is a boy scout. And he's, um, what is he, first class, second class? First class, I believe. He was second class, and now he's first class. So, put these on Thursday. So please comment below if you like a plan with me and you like how I'm doing it. This is my first time. I will be more than happy to do it um, maybe every other week. So it would be like twice a month. Um, Cause you know, it's tough doing the plan with me every week, especially once I get my job. So maybe every other or once a month, we'll see how I, I do. I also have a little daisy one for when my daughter starts, but I haven't heard yet, so that could be something. If it is next week, I'll add it in. Hopefully it fits our schedule. Okay. Next we're gonna do, in the middle, I do checklist to go with the colors. These again, I've printed myself. So I just go through, I do have, what colors am I doing, the purples, oh, which I gotta do the weekend one, and then a green, which I have a dark green, I think I'm gonna stick with pink and purple, but when I do have a lighter purple, um, maybe I'll do that. Let's see, so basically if I do these here, And I do have a bunch of these, but you never know with that they go with the colors you want. But I do have a variety of colors. Let's see, I'm trying to find a darker purple. Okay, so now that I got my list, to do list, I'm going to do pink and probably pink here and maybe purple here. <clears throat> so my first is I'm going to put Mondays. I am going to, on Tuesday, put that I'm going to put up my Halloween decor. This is my daughter's ballet to remind me. And that's for my YouTube. Um, so Monday we have trash night that I like to put on the bottom. And litter. Scoop that litter box. So I have my little trash can. And again I have, these are another little organizer that I have. Um, so yeah, if you um, enjoy my channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Um, that way you can be alerted when I have a new video. I do, I'm going to start trying to do some plan with these. I do DIYs. I do Dollar Tree hauls, Target hauls, Michael hauls. And I love to vlog. Um, check out our, this summer's <clears throat> family vacation vlog. We vlogged for a week. It was a lot of fun. My drawer, my cat litter. These I got from Hello Ashley Ann Prints. And I have a few left. This is what my mom got me for my birthday. And I put that right on over 
the trash. So that's my Monday. Um, so like again, Tuesday is going to be Halloween decor. Wednesday, I need to write in that I need to do my market list because on Thursday, I go to the market. So Wednesday, I write laundry day, which is going to be... I have different ones in laundry. Again, another one of these. I'll do just the laundry machine. Laundry I do on Fridays, which is today. So while I plan, I switch my laundry. So I'm gonna put this on Friday. Which, you know what? To put over here because I know I have to put the tape still so I'm gonna write in purple laundry and let's take a second and do my washi tape so what do we have here okay Friday school is dismissed early so I gotta remember that and then I had had a thing to say, get ready for my Halloween special dinner for the kids. And I've got that all planned. That's what was on here. So what I do want to do is keep that. And what I'll do is it's actually over here. Keep that there. What I'm going to do is for Friday... The dismissal. And I'm going to use one in my Erin Condred sticker book. One of these. Let's use the purple. We'll put that on Friday. Okay. So that's all set. So, oh, oh, this post it note we got left. Okay. So let's now go down to the YouTube that look like that and I will place them all here so Monday I'm doing my vlog video I'm gonna upload this weekend I will be vlogging I used to do one Monday Wednesday Friday Wednesday would be my DIY um, I don't know if I'll have a DIY ready Wednesday I should have um, a haul usually every week. So I'll put that in. And that'll be it for this week with YouTube because so I'm not sure. I can always fill it in later. My marketing. I do go to the market on Thursday. That will be here. I have a planner sticker to indicate when I do my planning. And me and my husband just decided I'm going to get a cheap, possibly Dollar Tree planner. I'm going to go look maybe today or tomorrow and um i'm gonna put that on friday and use another cheap planner as my our budget so we can keep track of the budget in there so that's exciting let's see i forgot this one i like to indicate days to vacuum um the kids' rooms we do, but I want to more indicate for like the living room. So usually I will vacuum on Tuesday, and that'll be on the bottom. And on Thursday, so every other day, I try to vacuum. And what I can do is I'll put it right here on Thursday and if I don't do it Thursday I'll do it 
Friday and it's like right there. So we'll put vacuum and on the weekend. And again, I'll put it towards the bottom. If it's Saturday, depending like if it's not Thursday, it's Friday, then I'll wait till Sunday. And then that's why I wait usually till Tuesday to vacuum again. Because I most likely did it Sunday. And so we'll put it here. But we'll see what happens. So at least it's every other day almost. One of my last things that I do, again in the little jar. And these I'm going to have to print up again soon. Are my rubber duckies that indicate when the children take their bath. It's been hard. We have, being that we have football and cheerleading till 7.30, sometimes quarter of eight, by the time we get in, and I like them to go to bed on a school night at 7.30, brush their teeth and get to bed. Um, so it's hard with the football season. I tried thinking we could do it in the mornings, that makes it a little bit more rush in the morning. It can be done. So it's kind of like, it's tough right now to say exactly when they're going to be. Um, like right now, it's Friday and they're going to need to bath tonight. If I put AM bath there. So I'll probably switch this one, and I'll do that now while I'm planning. Look back at the week now, for especially like baths. If they didn't get done that day, so I know to try and get it current with the next week. So we're gonna, probably after school, cause tonight we have a pasta dinner at six, um, and then we're camping out in the backyard tonight. So we're gonna put it down near YouTube, but it'll be no AM. All right, so if that happens, we're going to need to do a bath as, oh, I have it here. We're not gonna do Saturday AM. So see, things get switched around and that's why now I will again come back here and see if I need to add some cute stickers to fill in my week. And we'll put this over here and be definitely not AM. Okay, so knowing it's going to be Sunday afternoon, this week we'll probably stick with, because he had Tuesday. Ben has football, but Emma doesn't have her cheerleading. So she stays home. She can get her bath. And then as soon as he gets home, hopefully by 7.30, because we're just around the corner, he will get his bath. So we'll put that up here. And right in bath time. And I think I'm going to write PM. So I know what I was intending and then because if they win the game Monday night they um, don't have football practice but right now it's looking at Sunday they're gonna get a bath so I mean they could get a bath every night but it's hard so right now being they're only five and six you know every other night if they get very dirty then obviously we just give them a shower and then, see, Thursdays with Scouts, it should be 7.30. They're both home. So I could probably do Thursday night as well. Oh, I didn't get all that off. So we'll add Thursday night. And then we'll do... Next week we can do either Saturday or Sunday. And I'll just put it on Sunday, but we'll see. Sunday mornings they can't because they got football. So once that's done, then we could do it 
in the mornings on the weekend but I like to just keep it at night so we'll just add it over here so before game night they can do bath okay I didn't write bath time okay so the other thing I like to do is with this one here it's my new hot chocolate stickers I haven't been doing hot chocolate but I have been doing my tea that I have because we haven't purchased any of the Keurig hot chocolates yet I mean, these are tricky to open but. so what I'd like to do is go back and just put and I'll put tea they're really cute it's got a red hot chocolate mug and the steam coming up has hearts so I think that's really cute I'm gonna trim it down and let me think I didn't have any last night right no I had it and I think we'll just maybe put them down here for now I had it Wednesday so then I just come back the other thing I have is my weather that I wait till the like either a couple days will go by and I'll come over and I'll put them on I kind of will take like today it's sunny with some clouds so I put it right here with pen or pencil and I just put it right over and you don't even see it. So this is something usually I will backtrack on is I have the gas pump. I've been trying to keep track of gas but what we're going to do is once we get that other planner these will go in there. I just got gas this morning so I'm going to put it over here and this is usually a black right in twenty dollars and then I did Wednesday I had to put in ten pals um, I actually just and again these are things I backtrack and put in because I do I'm kind of keeping this as like a journal because I was doing my Fobonichi and I just stopped a couple weeks ago so I just mailed right yesterday yes so I'm gonna put this here and indicate that I mailed what I need to do is add my cute stickers so let's get my yeah, this weekend coming up so again thank you so much for watching and until next time enjoy that glitter Here's just a little extra. I'd like to show you some of my past spreads so you can see what I'm all about. So again, I do do the month. I put in just the special days. I put my goals on the side and I decorate it. This is this week. We're camping and like I said, in the backyard. So we did a camping theme. This is my My Little Pony week. This is my Owl's Week. I love these, really pretty. Back to school. This is my September. Watermelon theme. I like this one. I figured it was just the end of summer. Winnie the Pooh, my daughter, and my whole family has always loved. My brother loved Pooh, my mom loved Pooh, and my children have loved Pooh, especially my daughter. This was my mom's birthday, so I did a birthday theme. This was my vacation week with Minions. Up top was the different things we did each day, along with over here, and this was my Lisa Frank. August was Binions, but also indicating our road trip and our vacation. My anniversary, which was here. And then we celebrated a dinner over here. Ariel. My daughter loves Ariel. And me and my mother do, but she tells us, you can't. That's my favorite. She's five. <laughs> um, this was my butterfly week. I love butterflies. This is my summer theme. 
I just have like sea creatures, butterflies, flowers, pretty colors for the summer, and 4th of July. And this is where it began. This was my first spread. I got it on my birthday, June 23rd. Well, the party was a few days after that. So here's my July monthly spread. So again, thanks for watching. This was my little extra clip at the end. Thanks for watching till the end. And again, I hope you enjoyed. Give me a thumbs up and enjoy that glitter.